Good morning everybody. So right now I'm at the airport. I'm going to Toronto for a little getaway. I'm just at Starbucks right now grabbing a bite before I hit the plane. I'm gonna go to Toronto and just hang out a bit, eat, drink, and all that kind of stuff. And I'm gonna bring you guys along, so keep on watching. So here we got two cups of water. I got myself a vanilla latte and a ham croissant, which is like my go-to. Yum, so good. Alright everybody, we just landed in Toronto. They are three hours ahead, so right now it's like 6 p.m. We're gonna go and take the subway and we're gonna go to um, Melvin's friend's house. I'm actually here with Mel and I'm just super excited to explore Toronto. So we're purchasing our train tickets at this machine right here for Union Pearson Express um, and it's going to cost us $12.35 per person for one way. So um, there's a machine on your way to the train station that looks like this and you just purchase your ticket here. Only, it could only be Visa. And I Everybody. So last night I didn't end the vlog and I didn't even film the place where we went for dinner last night just because we're so exhausted from getting to Toronto. Um, we were like really like sweaty. It was actually really really hot here last night. Um, so yeah, we were like sweaty and gross. I just didn't feel like filming at all. Um, but yeah, today is our first official day in Toronto. Um, we woke up really early. Um, and Mel actually went workout downstairs. Their gym is like super nice. Um, but yeah, like right now it's around like 940. We are planning to go and check out the Eaton Mall. It's really close by. I think it might be like a 8 to 10 minute walk. I'm not exactly sure how far it is, but it's like super close. I can actually like see it from like our view here. Um, so yeah, it opens at 10 a.m. We might just pop by and just check it out first. And then later on, we're gonna come back here and I'm gonna grab my laptop. We're gonna head to a coffee shop nearby and just do some work first. And then we're gonna explore Toronto fully later on. So I'm gonna bring you guys all along for our adventures. So keep on watching. Okay guys, so first stop, we're gonna go and check out this coffee shop called Moss Moss Coffee. And we're actually staying really, really close by to it. So let's go check it out. So cute. To get a small coffee. So here you pick your cup size and then you just choose whatever you want. Yes. So what size is medium? I don't know what I want. They have a tiramisu latte. I think I'm just gonna get this a tiramisu latte. Yep. Thank you. This is my tiramisu latte. Never had a tiramisu latte before, so I can't wait to try it. It looks so nice. So here we're at this coffee shop called Moss Moss, and I got a tiramisu latte, which I've never seen a tiramisu latte before on the menu. So let's try this. It's actually really hot. Oh my god. This is so good. So good. Oh wow. I really, really like it. It's, it's so interesting. Love it. Mm. 
Now she tastes like tiramisu, but with coffee. I love it. I love it so much. All right, guys, we made it to Toronto Eaton Center, so let's go in. Everything got out of now. Cause they're all in fear of you. Don't want their harbor in. Don't want their do. chicken oh my god that looks so good how does it smell I'm not good with directions, but the Toronto sign is right in front of me and it's like a really big open space here um, Let me show you guys So yeah, we're just like walking towards it. There's that Toronto sign right there. I'll face the other way so you guys can take a peek later, but Yeah, it's nice Oh my god, it's so nice So we're at the Toronto sign So nice here so right behind me is the Toronto sign and then they have like this really cool fountain right here for photos. It looks really, really nice. Mel, what do you think of this place? It's pretty nice. Um, there's a lot of people here and it's really hot. <laughs> Surprisingly, the weather here is so hot. Like I'm wearing a cardigan and I'm like about to sweat. Like it's pretty hot here in like September, which is pretty crazy. But yeah, it's like beautiful skies though, so that's a plus. food trucks around the area near the Toronto sign and they have hot dogs for $1.99 uh, 50 cent water like really really cheap stuff here
local gnocchi, which is like the winning dish that beat Bobby Flay. So I'm super excited to give this one a try. Is it actually like a winning dish, you think? the butter chicken poutine. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Alright guys, so next we have the butter chicken poutine. It's kind of loud in here, so hopefully you guys can hear me. Right here. It's really good too. We're at this place called Bok Chong Chong Su Tofu. It's so busy in here. Bok Chang Dong Soon. There's the menu. The water. So we got a water bottle filled with water. Legit 16 on Instagram. Follow me. Thank you. So here we have some appetizers. We have a raw egg, some bean sprouts, some kimchi stuff, and I think that's like natto. Eggs, ooh, dumplings. So we have the rice right here. It comes into like these the little things. I think it's pouring in. Yeah, right. So it becomes like a pouring in if, if I uh, put the water. So you can eat everything in here. I got the seafood one, Mel got the beef, and then Jared got a soup beef with everything. guys I'm just gonna end the night here um, the Korean restaurant was actually really really good um, and it was also really really busy but if you guys end up getting the one that I got I got the number two which was a seafood um, soup with tofu I recommend getting it in mild just like that tiny bit of spice would just kick it off and like make it taste so much better but like the soup itself was just like really really good um and then um the ones that my brother and like my brother's friend got it looked really really good as well um but yeah like that place is like really it was really really busy so it must be like a very popular joint um it's like the section where like there's like a bunch of like korean restaurants um so if you guys are into korean food then maybe like that's the section that you guys want to check out but yeah, I'm really tired, so I'm just going to call it a night here. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Remember to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and comment down below. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!